When Image Lab software indicates that the UV lamps in the gel dock EZ need to be replaced, the process of replacement is, well, easy. So let's gather our tools and get to work. You'll want a Phillips screwdriver, a small cup or beaker to hold the screws as you remove them, and your new bulbs. To begin, turn off the instrument and unplug it from the power source. Then remove the seven screws around the outside edge of the gel dock EZ, leaving the screw at the bottom left corner in place. Here's where that cup or beaker might come in handy. Once you've removed all seven screws, carefully slide the cover toward the back of the imager and set it aside. Now locate and remove the screw holding the lamp assembly drawer in place. Slide the bulb drawer out until you see all four lamps. The drawer may stick at first, so you might have to give it a firm tug. Remove the lamps by twisting counterclockwise and slip them out of position. Replace each of the lamps and twist clockwise to lock them in place. And remember, even though only one lamp might have burned out, it's best to replace all the lamps at the same time to provide even illumination for gel images. Once you've replaced all four bulbs, slide the lamp drawer back in and replace the securing screw. You may need to push the side of the drawer down next to the screw tab so that the holes align. If the lamp drawer is not properly replaced, you may see a light tray not detected message when you restart the instrument. Finally, slide the cover back onto the instrument and replace the screws. Once the cover is on and all of the screws have been replaced, you can reconnect the power and your gel dock EZ is ready to go. Remember to subscribe to our BioRad Life Science YouTube channel where you'll find lots of helpful videos like this one. And as always, if you have questions about any of your BioRad products, please don't hesitate to write to us at support at bio-rad.com.